It's hot. I had to get in the water. Look, y'all. I had to get in the damn water. Even the damn water is hot. It's like lukewarm. You got alcohol? Is it alcohol? Oh, yeah. Young Desert. Welcome back to my channel. As you can tell, we are doing a vloggy vlog today. First things first, I'm gonna unpack my new camera. Technically, it's already unpacked, honestly, y'all. Like, I would be just lying my ass off right now if I was to be like, oh, I'm unboxing my new camera. Like, girl, it's been unboxed, okay? But we're gonna pretend like it's not. Before we get into this video, of course, y'all know what y'all gotta do. Go follow me on my social media at J-I-M-I-P underscore. We live on Instagram and Twitter, so make sure y'all go follow me on there. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below as well. Hit that bell right next to it so you can know if I wanna upload all my videos. And that is it. That is all, period. Let's get into this unboxing. So, as y'all know, I think some of y'all know by now because I've been posting it on Instagram. Um, I wanted to get a new camera because, don't get me wrong, I love my Sony A5000. I love it, I love you, I love you, I really do. But, um, you know, your girl moving up in the world all that when it comes to this YouTube shit. So, I was really like, I really need to get a new camera and just invest in a new camera. So, I went ahead and ordered a new camera and I decided to get the Canon EOS M50 and I got the kit lens that comes with it. I believe it's the 15 millimeter and 15 millimeter and I think it's 15 to 35 millimeter lens or 45, 55, 45, sorry. So 15 to 45 milliliter lens. It's the kit lens, damn it. It's the one that everybody got. So anyway, it came in a box like this, of course. And um, inside of it, it was bubble wrapped up and all of that good stuff, you know, just to keep it safe. That's it safe. Safe. And then, of course, this is the box that it came in. It came in an actual Canon box, of course. So, my legs are, I can't sit up like that. Let me put y'all down here. That's cool. That's cool. I could have been did that the whole time. I'm ass. Anyway. So yeah, it came in a Canon box or whatever, and I believe I got it from Powerboy. Um, I don't know where I ordered it from. I think I ordered it from, I don't know where the fuck I ordered it from. But anyway, um, yeah, I bought a camera from the website, and I believe altogether I paid like six, so $630. And I also decided to get a mic as well. So so this is the microphone right here. I got the mobile mic. So when it comes to the camera, I was in between. I was like, should I get the Canon M50 or should I get the Canon G7X? Y'all know that's like YouTubers' favorite cameras. Like every YouTuber that's like middle class-ish, like the ones that are like, okay, I'm gonna take this serious and like really invest in a camera. They always get either the M50 or the G7X. So I was going back and forth. I was like, oh, which one to get? I decided to go with the M50 because the M50 has an internal mic input. So the G7X does not have an internal mic input, so you can't put a mic on it. And also, why did I want to get the G7X? Something else about the G7X that I didn't like, and I was like, mm-mm, I ain't got time for that. So I decided to go ahead and get the Canon M50. Um, I literally, it took me like a week for me to like really sit down and like put everything together and be like, okay, go through the specs, see what's better, see what's different, blah, blah, blah. Um, as y'all know, the Canon M50, oh, that's what I didn't like. The Canon G7X didn't have an interchangeable lens. I wanna be able to get a bigger lens if necessary, like later on. So the G7X, you can't change out the lens, but the M50, you can. So the two main things that I wanted in the camera was a microphone and a better lens. So it comes with like the little strap that you put on the camera that I actually need to put on there because child, I don't even know why it's not on there. Um, and then of course it comes with, and this actually came on it, but <laughs> I took it off. So it comes with the Canon thing. So this goes in the back of the, the lens to protect it. And then it comes with this one right here. I, don't, I forgot what this one is protecting this protect one of them i think protect both of them actually and then you got this one right here and this one goes on the front so 
that clips onto the front of the lens to protect that. Then of course it came with the Canon charger pack or whatever. So it's like a little thingy. You plug it up into the wall like so. And then this is the battery and then you just plug the battery in there. You plug it up to the wall and it charges. So what I've learned, because I've had the camera now for like five days, it dies like that, bitch, like it dies. So what I'm gonna have to do is go ahead, and I heard I heard that the like Canon cameras die really fast, but so does the Sony A5000. So um, what I'm gonna go ahead and do is just order the, it's a two pack charger pack or something like that, and it's only like $25. So I'm gonna do that. I think I ordered it off of Amazon. Child, I think I actually ordered the damn thing off Amazon. I don't know, I forgot where I ordered it from. But anyway, yeah, and it also came with a little cord that you can plug up into the computer and it plugs into the laptop so it can transfer all of the videos. So now let's get into the camera. All right, y'all, so here is the M50, the Canon M50. So I'm gonna take everything off of it right now because this is my mic my let's say my mic this is my stand that I got from Amazon and then this is the actual microphone that I got from Amazon as well and I'm gonna show y'all all about the microphone too I just want to take it off so y'all can see the camera all by itself this is the Canon M50 as y'all can see it's pretty big the lens is out right now so that is me putting the lens in. So this is what it looks like with the lens in. And then this is what it looks like with the lens out. That is extended all the way out. So it has a great zoom, which I love. And then the zoom is like really clean cut because it has this compared to the um, the um, A5000. This is the zoom, pretty choppy, you know? Compared to this one, it's just in, out, in, out, real clean and real smooth. Um, so it has Wi-Fi capability. It has the HDMI port. That's the Wi-Fi over here. It has all whole bunch of different types of settings. Um, it has the viewfinder in here. This is the top part where you put the microphone at. Um, of course, you have the battery and the um, HD SD card goes in there. Um, of course, like I said, interchangeable lens. So you literally just, oh, wait, 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 wait. You press this little button right here on the side and then the lens comes out like so. So the heavy part is really the lens, it's not even really the camera. Let me put this back on. Um, and then this is the mic. So I got the Movo mic. I was in between the Movo and the Rode mic. Um, so the Rode mic is a lot more expensive, that's number one. I wasn't really trying to take the, the cheap route when it comes to buying new equipment for y'all or whatever. Um, but when I was doing my research on the Movo and the Rode, apparently um, for the Canon M50 specifically, the, they said that the Movo mic is way better, it just has a better quality. I don't know why, but when I was doing my research and I was like trying to figure out which one was better, um, when I was comparing the two, the Movo actually did sound a lot better to me. So yeah, you just slide it onto the top piece and then boom, you have a microphone and then you plug that up to the side and then this one plugs up to the back like this. And then boom, you're a whole YouTuber. <laughs> so yeah, that is my new Canon M50. So what I'm about to do now is switch out cameras. So this is the Sony A5000. And now the next clip y'all see is gonna be the Canon M50. All right, y'all, so this is the Canon M50. I've switched lenses and I did nothing when it comes to trying to brighten the screen or anything. Like this is just how the M50 looks. I cut it on and I press record. Um, what I love about the M50 is the, I believe it's, it has to do with the shutter. It's crazy because I went to school for this stuff and I feel like I should know it by heart now, but I honestly don't. But I believe the shutter speed is a lot better in the Canon M50, which allows the light to come in more. So it takes in a lot more light. When I had my Sony A5000 on, I had my ring light on, but it was still like kind of like dark and it's just weird. But when I do my Canon M50, when I have my ring light on, it just takes in so much light, which I love. So, um, another thing about the Canon M50 is it's touchscreen. So I can go in right now and I am brightening by touching the screen. And, oh, my nails, my nails are long, y'all. So hold on, bear with me. And then I'm lessening it. 
yeah, there we go. I'm like turning it down and turning it up throughout the whole thing. So that is me touching the screen. Um, I can literally go through all of the controls and it's just really, really, really good. Another thing that I loved about the Canon M50, um, I can do live remote shooting. So right on my phone, I can pull up the Canon app and I can do live remote shooting. I just need to be in play. So I can't do it right now because I'm recording. I would have to stop and then do it. And you know, it's just too damn much. But y'all get the point. It does do live remote shooting. It says it right here. I should show y'all, shouldn't I? I'm gonna show y'all, hold on. Okay, so it is live remote shooting now. So y'all see that? It is me right now in live, live view. Um, I am recording and you can see it on the phone. So this helps a lot when I am doing a video and like say it's not, um, you know, just checking out my hair and stuff, making sure the lighting is good, making sure I am in focus, like my face is in focus and everything else is blurred out. Um, I can go in through the settings and change the like um, aperture. I can change the like the blurriness of the background, the brightness, all that good stuff. I can change that right on my phone while I'm like, you know, while I'm sitting recording because sometimes the camera is like really far away from me. So it's really hard to like, huh, I gotta get up and I gotta go change it and I gotta do this and I gotta do that and it's just really annoying. So it is very handy and helpful that I can do it from my phone. Now the Sony also has an app as well, but it's not live remote shooting. It's strictly for pictures. Like you can use it to take pictures, but that's about it. <laughs> that's it. And the price difference, of course, my I paid 300, I think, for my, um, my Sony. Then I lost the lens and the lens was like a hundred dollars. So like it's, it, it rounds up to like four or 500 if you break the lens. Cause the thing about the Sony A5000 lens, it breaks, you can tap it too hard and it'll break. So yeah, it's crazy. The Sony lens is um, interchangeable though. Very interchangeable, but their lenses, man. I mean, I mean, I, I, I bought, three lenses for this camera. Like it just doesn't make any sense how many times I've bought a lens. Like it is just insane. So um, yeah, that sucks. But yeah, um, um, the Canon is my new camera and I'm still trying to decide if I want to sell the Sony or not. Like, I, you know, I may just want to keep it for like, I don't fucking know, I don't know. Just for backup or something, like I don't know. But um, if I do decide to sell it, I'll probably put it on eBay or I'll just make a post and if anybody wants to buy it, they can slide in my DMs. I'll probably charge like 250 for it. I'm not gonna charge the full amount. I think I paid like 360 or something like that. Probably charge 250 for it because it's in mint condition. The lens is new because again, I broke the lens. So the lens is brand new now and um, it's a really good camera still. I still love it. But girl, when I got the quality for that Canon M50, I said, damn, I've been missing out. I've been missing out because in my last story time, y'all was like, damn, the quality of your video is so good. I'm like, thank you, it's the M50, period, okay? So yeah, that is my new camera. Um, I just wanted to come on here and do my intro and tell y'all about the camera because I freaking didn't ran out of time to record my intro before the vlog actually got started. So next clip you're gonna see is uh, me and Zabrina and everybody else at her video shoot. That was literally the best video shoot ever and it was so much going on y'all but enjoy that and then y'all gonna see me back in the same position at the end of this video <laughs> basically giving my outro and giving my goodbyes so yeah let's get into the video okay, so we are outside of this airbnb that we are do, um using for Sabrina's um what do I even call it her video shoot so she's dropping a video real real soon she's dropping the song real real soon and the next thing you know we're gonna have an EP and an album and a mixtape and all that okay period hi y'all this, this is Sabrina and not only I'm an artist I'm a business woman as well don't get hit by the car <laughs> let's take a tour of the airbnb and then you walk in they got this cute little island that's Granny. Hi. Oh. <laughs> we have a cool closet. It's really cute in here. And then we go to this store. And we have the bathroom. Oh, and the bathroom is so cute. Mind you, this is just an Airbnb, y'all. But of course, y'all can rent it out. Or y'all can, you know, have a proper in here. 
I look Mom, really I'm fat like, because your girl is a canyon, okay? But yeah, so this is the bathroom. Double set, humongous mirror. And you come through this door. Oh my god, this closet is humongous. It's like humongous in here. Jeez, look at this, look at this, look at this, look at this. This closet is crazy. They have like a little cute mirror right here. I don't know what anybody's gonna do with this little ass mirror, but okay. And then you go back out of the closet. Shower on oh a big, um, what's it called? Like flower bath, whatever the hell it's called. Like the humongous bathtub, the big ones that you can like really soak in. Maybe they call it soap, it's soap or the shore. Toilet, and then you walk into the yeah. Oh shit, awesome. you're good, baby. Very high ceiling, ceiling thing. She used to it. And you get a window, real big window. So oh, all y'all stuff is gonna be in here. Okay. This is gonna be like cute. Yes, ma'am. Really. You know, I got it. I am I have some. Anybody in some part of the I'm sorry. It's this door. Like why not just put a balcony? I don't get it. But you go out onto the like little deck porch balcony area or whatever. And then you get the whole view of downtown. So you got a big little area out here, but it's just stupid that this is a door. Like, I don't like that. She got this humongous bottle. It's big as hell. I think it's a fifth. Is it a fifth? This is Arena's best friend. Yeah. What's <laughs> good? We about to take a shiz out because listen. Cheers. PD video shiz. Yeah. Oh God. <laughs> So, I'm about to order some food because your girl is hungry, but I don't like, listen, Sabrina Granny was like, don't eat nothing too heavy because in the video shoot, you know, the, the camera add on like 10 pounds, mm -hmm. bitch, I'm already big. Okay. She always cheers to Damn, Sabrina's Okay. Cheers. Yeah. To my most biggest bitch. Why is she doing video shoot? Hey, man. Y'all gonna love it. Thanks to everybody that's coming. I work really hard and put a lot of investment into myself. And I really believe in my dream. And I'm making my dreams come to reality. And I hope y'all enjoy my music video. And when it comes out, y'all gonna When you your own hairstylist and makeup artist. But you know what I'm saying? But in the next couple of years, you have barely even had bitches gonna be having like, bitches gonna be all four hairstylists at one time. One bitch gonna have Eric Tay. I'm coming to you. I'll give a fuck what Nikki talk about, bitch. <laughs> we knew that bang not was not yours. I knew that bang. When that bang like Tay no, Bang. No, it don't look like Tay Bang. Tay, that's Tay a bang. Bang. Not the bang. Bang. Yeah, that's that's the bang. That's a bang. That ain't yeah. no bang. I'm on hookah duty. So, this is the hookah I got her for her birthday that she still ain't open because she ain't cheap. But, I'm about to spark up the hookah. Is this, it's not even no instructions. Um, I think this, that don't go on that. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Six hours later. Okay, listen, we got it done. And it's probably not even right, but it's gonna work. And if it don't hit right, then we know we did something wrong. Okay, listen. There ain't no video shit without no, no chicken. Period. Look at that. Ooh. I didn't know that's right. Hey, it go right here. So I mean, it's right here. I want you to sit it over here with the rest of this alcohol. Oh, I got the blender. I'm talking about the movie. Hey China. <laughs> the star. Period. Period. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, 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 they are still in the Airbnb getting ready. And I am about to go up to the roof to go to the pool. So I can check out a pool. They said that it is pretty. So we about to see. I need to find the elevator though. All right y'all, so this is what we given. Okay, this is what we given. And it's so pretty out here. And you literally see the whole downtown is so pretty. 
right oh my god i love the city view that's like so dope and like look over there y'all see that i want to say that's midtown but don't don't get me the line so let's take a thumbnail so now we're just waiting for everybody else to come up here they have the camera and everything already set up so we're just waiting for the star to come up here i'm about to get my cute ass in the pool though i ain't gonna cap to you but yeah I'm about to go back inside because it's hot as hell out here and wait for them. Parking all on the page high. Told the toe, you ain't ready high. I'm too low. Is you slow? If a bitch wanna go, tell that hoe. Hold on, 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 hoe. Child, they talking about something we can't record, so we have to literally break down everything. And the security, where's she at? Her ass, I don't even know where she at. Her, her right though. Just being a whole bitch. She just came up to us, she was so rude. Like, take all that down, y'all can't do that. And then she gonna close the pool. Yeah. Who get, <laughs> no, this whole thing. I mean like, I ain't never in my life. I feel like somebody either went down there and said something. Oh, her. But I don't know if I won't know. No, it probably was, huh? She did walk in and walk And then hoes hating. That's really what it is. Man, I swear, the devil work hard, but guess what? It's the fashion. Mm-mm. God work harder, okay? <laughs> All right, y'all. So that is the end of this vlog. Um, it is Wednesday. This vlog was supposed to go up today, but I'll probably just post it tomorrow. No big deal. Um, and then I'll have another video up Friday, the haul video. So y'all are really gonna like that. That's gonna be a really cute video. And of course, Sunday story time, period. I don't know what I'll make a story time about this week. Honestly, like, I don't know what I'll make a story time about. Gotta start thinking about some stuff, probably some old stuff, probably nothing Atlanta related, but still gonna be a good story time, period, okay? I was supposed to go to the bank today, um, but it's 5.31 and um, I got up at like 10, so I got up kind of late, but I still, you know, I got up a little early. I recorded, about to edit, so probably have to go to the bank tomorrow, but it's fine either way. Um, I'm about to go and edit this video so it can be up on time tomorrow. Hopefully it'll be up by three o'clock, but if y'all see this and it's up at three, Give your girl a hand clap, okay, period. Y'all, I'm about to go ahead and edit. Um, I'm about to listen to um, my Billionaire Babes Club ebook. I told y'all about this in my story time, but if you did see my story time, then um, go check it out. It's Billionaire Babes Club. It's, it's basically a book of, of like wives and girlfriends and how they bag their rich guy and their wealthy guy. Like they just spill all the tea in it. So I've been, I've been reading it, I'm like, probably now like halfway through. So I'm about to go ahead and have that playing on my phone while I edit this video and just get all the good gems and tea. That scared the shit out of me. So I'm gonna leave the link down below in the description box. It'll be the free chapter that you get just to get the like feel of it and see if you like it. And then I'm gonna put the actual link to purchase the ebook as well, okay? Period. Hopefully I will have an update on the apartment soon. I'm working with somebody else now. As y'all know, y'all seen the story time I did about the girl. Long story short, update on her. If you haven't been hip to Instagram and Twitter, she basically took to Instagram and Twitter to make it seem as if she is so innocent and I'm such a bad person for posting her on my social media, on my YouTube and making a video about it and blah, blah, blah. And making it seem like, oh, I refunded you your money. Like, no, you refunded me my money once I made the video. And then she even said, I would have been nothing but nice to you. I've been responding to you. You actually weren't. So I just think it's so funny because she tried so hard to lie, but I was very transparent in that video. When I, when she gave me my refunds, I, really? When she gave me my refunds, I let y'all know, but she finally gave me my final refund, the 175. Yes, well, what, yesterday, I think? I don't know, but 
I blocked her on everything and she's basically trying to flip the script, make it seem like I'm using her name for clickbait and I really am truly in love with her and I'm just obsessed with her and I need her name for views and I'm just like, baby, do you know my story times do numbers every Sunday? Cut the bullshit, ho, okay? But anyway, that is all, folks. Um, thank y'all for watching this video. Um, I have a lot more videos coming for y'all. I can't wait for y'all to see. We are almost at 10K! Are y'all like... Are y'all like serious right now? We're almost at 10K subscribers. That is insane. Like, I've always thought about this day. Well, I remember when I hit 1,000 subscribers, and this one lash is just hanging on for their life. I remember when I hit 1,000 subscribers and I honestly felt like 10K was never even like, in, like when I hit 1,000 subscribers, I was just like, oh, like 10K is like the biggest, like longest road. Like it's just, I just, in my mind, it wasn't achievable. Like me hitting 10K wasn't achievable. And I just, just thought I was gonna have to sell my sex tape to even hit 5K on, on YouTube. So for me to almost be at 10K, like it's just crazy to me. And I'm just really excited because it's so many brands that have been hitting me up. Like y'all, we got so many brand deals coming. Like it don't even make no sense. Like I'm at 10K subscribers and I'm I, I'm, I'm getting, you know, like brand deals that from people that I used to look up to. Like when Aaliyah J used to get her brand deals like five, six years ago, like, I was like, damn, like, I wish I could work with them. Like, you know what I mean? So it's just crazy to me that these brands are like reaching out to me now. So yeah, that's all that I wanted to say. We almost at 10K. I have a huge giveaway at 10K. So please hurry up and get us to 10K so we can get to the, the giveaway. Like, I'm excited. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm about to spend a bag on y'all for this giveaway, okay? So yeah, that's all. I'm gonna stop rambling. Um, for watching this video, if you made it this far, y'all already know, hit that subscribe button down below. Go follow me on all my social media at JIMIP underscore, okay? If you haven't already, you probably missed all the drama from last Monday story time, Sunday story time, you know what I mean. So yeah, you probably missed all the drama on Twitter and Instagram about that girl. But it's okay, you don't want to miss out on anything else, so make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. And leave me some comments down below, y'all. I'll see y'all in my next video.